Hello everyone, in this video, I'm going to teach you how to add a new font and colors to Tailwind version 4 in Vue project. I have installed Tailwind CSS from the previous video. And if you don't know how to install Tailwind version 4 in Vue projects, I highly recommend you watch my previous video. I will put the link in the description. This video is pretty short. You can watch it and apply it to your project directly. First of all, let's go to the Tailwind documentation. Go to tailwindcss.com and then click on get started and then go to adding custom styles. Over here is how you can add custom font and custom color into Tailwind. You will add them to add theme inside the curly braces in the CSS files. Normally in the previous version, version 3, we add it to tailwind.config.js. In Tailwind CSS 4, we just add the custom font and color inside styles.css directly. Over here, we put add theme, curly braces, and then we add color over here. Here's how you can add color. For example, over here, you can put dash dash and then put color. And then for example, you want to name the color primary. And then you can add the color. It can be a hexadecimal color. For example, over here, I will put orange color, FF5733. And then if I go back to the component, for example, this component, and I can call the color over here. Let's put BG primary. See, you will see the custom color over here. And let me open the project. You will see the orange color down here. For example, if I put like secondary color and I put 0, 0, F, 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 save. And if I create a div over here and I put hello aqua and then I can put class over here, text secondary, save. And if I go here, I see the custom color. The next step, we are going to add a custom font. Okay, let me search font from Google font. Okay, and then click on over here. I will use this font, Doto, because its appearance is quite different from others. Okay, and I click on get font, and then I click on get embedded code. And I can click on import. So I don't want to download this one. I can import it directly from Google. So I just copy this one and go back to our project and then on styles.cs on top of Tailwind CSS, just paste the import font over here. And then let's go back to the documentation. This is how you can add a new font. For example, I will add it's over here, that dash font and then I can follow with the name of the font for example Doto something like this and then I can put like Doto and then the next font if this one doesn't work can be sans serif okay just paste this one over here save it and let's go back to hello tailwind component and over here let me use that font font.doto save it and let me go back to the application you will see the font doto has applied to this hello aqua how about you want to put the font in your project instead of uploading it from google uh, let's go back here and let's download this font okay after the download is done let's open this up and then let's extract this one Go inside the static folder and let's copy a font over here. I will copy dot regular and go back to our project. Let me open this folder. The view in Explorer. Okay. And in source over here in asset, I will create a folder over here. And name is fonts. And I will paste the font over here. Okay, let me go back to the projects. If you go to here, you will see asset and you will see font folder over here. So you can remove this one and you can import the font over here directly. I just put add font face over here, curly braces, 
and then just put font family the name of the font family you can name is whatever you want i can name is uh like doto okay and then put source and put url uh, put double curly braces and then go to the source folder and then go to asset and fonts and use that font so in doto over here we import it here and we use in tailwind it should work the same okay let's refresh this one see if i remove this one it won't work see if i put this back it's work and if i create another div and apply it class text red 500 and then i put font doto hello save you see it's work the same if you like this video feel free to like subscribe and don't forget to comment down below